thank you for stopping by as the grant we were waiting for is finally coming to an end the popular saying right now in the grant community is that we are counting days congratulations to the subscribers of uah grant and every other grant in nigeria the trending issues after the uh, meeting held with the government disbursement committee and together with apostle kenan some key people in the grant ecosystem now people are jubilating after the meeting that disbursement will soon happen and we are expecting huge sum of money that will take care of our business that will help people to establish business and live good as expected we spend so much subscribing to this grant and now this is the end of the whole struggle this is saying right now that we are counting this let's believe and hope that uaag will disburse and also our grant pressure group will disburse a grant to nigerian masses or what we want right now is the money not fighting not uh discrimination we need the money the masses need the money subscribe as we will update you on what is happening in uag we are here to update you on what is happening in all grand pressure group there's a two grant we currently expecting any moment from now listen to pastor joel coming out to tell the people that we should keep calm and that we are counting this the money will be dispersed very soon subscribe if you are new good evening house my name is pastor peter joel for god i want to use this opportunity to appreciate every one of us in on, on this platform i want to appreciate you for your patience um, it is not an easy thing it is not an easy thing everyone on this platform have endured everyone on the uh, grand ecosystem have uh, have endured but uh, i want to let you know that the days we have now is shorter than the one that we have spent we can be counting days from now yes with what is happening now i can say that we are counting days not not moons again as as it used to be please uh many people have been chatting me asking me what is happening what is happening uh, you know once a man is far from information He'll be wary, confused, and depressed. Information is very good. That's why I came up this uh, evening to let you know that. As I told you in the previous week, I told you that that was the last weekend. That after the, that weekend, the following week, work will start. And people we are thinking that uh, people are saying that i am hyping people this and that and the following week which was last week things started happening as you can see now the uh, ngo apps are down all the apps are down. no ngo can assess his or her app now and it's for a reason and by the special grace of god the ngos are waiting for the mou to come up with the app when the app comes up they are expecting the mou to come out with to, to come up with, with it and once the uh, uh, mou comes up you know that the money is already in your doorstep so that means it is done the apps cannot be down for nothing i told you people that the work have started a uag cannot be telling us everything that is not meant for public consumption they cannot be putting all these things on the social media i'm not even supposed to be saying things that i should not be saying there are things that if i know i should not be voicing it out on the social media but i want to assure you that now by the special grace of God, we are good to go. It is not like before. 
that they will tell us uh, uh, this week, next week, uh, and they are not doing anything. They will conclude that the disbursement, they will start it. Our grand pressure will, group, they will say, no, we are not satisfied with 20%. We want more. We want more percentage. Greediness. And they will start dragging it. That week we go. That month we go. Next month they will decide again. They say, okay, we said uh, they will give us month again. They will give us date. And they, in between, the same all grand pressure group, they will, they will, they will do one or two things to delay it again. Meanwhile, they were registering other NGOs, registering people, planning to to overthrow the 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 the, the, the government at hand. But God has taken control see when god speaks everything bows it can take time but it will it will surely come to pass when all these things were happening and they, they were saying uh, uh the name of uh apostle ken wakama is no more there uh, this and that it is a a, a, a PG and that we disbursed now i was remembering the talk what uh, apostle ken said when they were uh, doing the remembrance of uh, uh, Mama Rita, Mrs. Odudu, that he, he said that God told him that you will be sharing money to Nigerians. When I remember it, I said, ah, but can the word of God drop to the ground? I just encouraged myself because prophecy, senior you, prophecy is a thing that you cannot, you cannot, find, you cannot even describe. When I remember it, I said, well, if it is APGN, well, let the will of God be done. But at the end, that word of God, what God told him 20 years ago, say, I in 20 years in 20 years to come, you will be sharing money to Nigerians. And Apostle Ken was not happy. He said, I am asking you for house rent and for school fees for my for my children. You are telling me that in 20 years I will be sharing money to Nigerians. And that last year was the 20 years. It has come to pass. And we are on it now. If not the delay, it would have happened that last year. It would have happened at least December or thereabout or January. But I thank God the word of God still comes to pass. Because the enemy that has been delaying the, the, the disbursement they has been driven away into the forest and the, by the special grace of God you will see what I'm telling you you know I told you that was the last weekend people were thinking that it was a joke and the last week the real work started I told you the following week the work will start and the, now they are in the work the, the, the work is really going on by the special grace of God. I, I don't know the date, but I know we are closer than before. And now it is real. It is more real than before. Before, we don't even know whether it is our grand pressure group, whether our grand pressure group even have money. We don't, I was asking somebody, I say, when did our grand pressure group travel abroad to source grant? Are they not here with me and them? How, when, 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 when did they go, when they travel to abroad to source grant? I told somebody, that person, no, these people don't have money. And they were saying they will this boy. And today, it is clear that they don't have money. They don't even have palliative. Where will they get it? That's why I told you that after this grant, by the special grace of God, you can see palliative, but to see grant again in Nigeria, go and write this and that. I keep saying it. There is no light. There is no light again after this UAG. You can see palliative, but to see grant again in this Nigeria, it is only God that will, by his mercy, that will bring grant again to drop for all, any other NGO to disburse grant here. They can disburse palliative, but grant, that is why we should hold UAG very, very well and maximize any opportunity so that you will see what I'm telling you now. You will see it now. All these ones, Saint Rita, Saint Mama, uh, uh, Theobat, I was telling them, none of them have money. It is clear that it is this same 
document all of them are sorting for putting hand to get because they know the 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 last uh, beneficiary is dead and they want to grab it and disperse to but all of them i don't want to be mentioning them but after now to see grant 